Uh, hey everyone. If you saw my last video, iPhone prank call 8, I said that I would do two videos today. Instead, I'm going to do four videos today. It's going to be a video bonanza. Screw that. That's, that's terrible. Right? That, was, that was terrible. Oh my god. That was, that sucked. That was bad. Whatever. Guess what? Prank call to T-Mobile. I used to have their company for about a year. I hated them. So now, I'm going to show my hate in a prank call. Let me basically tell you what it's about before I do anything. This prank call is going to be really funny because it's going to basically be asking for the Sidekick 5. They're going to be all like, we don't have that. I have do you have the sidekick four? No. Do you have the sidekick three? Yeah. Do you have the sidekick LX? Yeah. I want sidekick one, two, three, and LX. I want to compare them all. Hold on. All right. Now let me just search for them on my maps. It's the number one way to do prank calls. Calling. Here we go. By the way, the last one I just hung up. She was talking way too long, I swear. It was like, bang, 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 bang. I don't have to know the calling. Uh, yes, um, hello. I'm calling about the Sidekick 5. Do you guys have the Sidekick 5 in stock? No, we don't have it. It was taken by us. We don't know when we're going to get that. You don't know when you're, you're going to get a Sidekick 5? Can you tell me about the Sidekick 4? The Sidekick LX? What do you want to know about it? No, not the Sidekick LX, the Sidekick 4. That is the Sidekick 4. So the LX is the Sidekick 4? Yeah. Okay, um, how about the Sidekick 3? Is that any, what's the difference between the... You don't have the Sidekick 3 anymore? No. You got rid of that? Yeah. So I'm taking that you don't have 1 or 2 either? No, those have been off the market for a long time now. So when you get a new psychic, you just take the old one off the market? Yeah. Wow, okay. Um, the psychic LX, what does that have to offer than those average sidekicks? Because I have a psychic 3 still, and, well, I want to know what's the difference between the LX and the psychic 3. Okay, can you hold on a second? Sure. Hello? Hello? Holy crap, they hung up on me. Can you believe these people? Jesus. And it's only 222 seconds so far, wow. Sucks. <laughs> Jesus. Well, they ruined this one. Let's call this team mobile up. You're calling team mobile. This is Jason speaking. Right now, please. Uh, yeah, Jason, was it? Yes. Um, I'm calling about the Psychic LX. Okay. Um, I have the Psychic 3 still, and I want to know what's the difference between the LX and the 3. The LX has a faster processor, memory card, better camera. That's it? Basically, yeah. And what's the price for the LX? 350 I paid about 350 for my 3, but then again, that's when the 3 came out. Um, yeah. How about the backing? Like, is the um, style of it still the same? Like, you know, the old flip thing? Yes, it's still the same. It's a little skinnier, but it's still the same. Interesting. Um, how about the, like, appearance of it? Is that any different? Did, do you, like, change anything about that one? On which one? 
on the LX, did you change any of the um, appearance things on it? No, it's basically the same. It's basically the same as the three, except with just better memory card and all that? Yes. I see. Um, okay. No, I'm not done here. Okay. Um, I'm trying to figure out, because I still have the um, three. I have an iPhone, because, you know, I'm a really busy person here. I need, uh, like, four phones. And I'm wondering to, uh, if I should do, dump the three and get the LX. Would that be a smart choice? If you want a faster processor and everything like that, yeah, yeah, it would be. Okay. Um, I'll stop in your store about, uh, let's say, um, tomorrow at noon. Okay. And I'm gonna basically get the LX, and I'll call back in about two days, and I'll just, you know, give you my um, perspective on it. Okay. All right, later. Okay. Bye. I'm gonna call back, and I'm gonna give you my perspective. <laughs> they don't want to hear my perspective. Now hold on, I was at McDonald's recently. And I don't like McDonald's. So, let's do a prank call. By the way, not many people have been commenting on my prank calls. So, tell you what, I'm basically gonna do this. If you don't call and comment on my prank calls, I'm gonna stop. All right, another thing. You can comment on any place you want me to, um, you know, prank call on. You can comment, like, call Target and do a prank call on them. Tell me what the prank call is. It's like Elvis Duran in the Morning Zoo phone taps. Please. All right, let's turn this down first one. Here we go. Let's do this. Um, yeah, what's that in the background? Right there, uh, is that, are you guys busy right now? They hung up on me too. Jesus! Um, yeah, I, I was there about uh, a day ago at your McDonald's, and um, when I went through the drive-thru, I ordered a Big Mac with a medium Diet Coke, and when I got home to, you know, eat and everything, because I was starving that day, um, they really messed up my order. They gave me a number three, which is like the double quarter pounder or whatever, I can't even remember what it was, and a large Coke, like regular Coke. Um, is there something I can do about that, or is there like a line that I can basically comment on? Give me a second, okay? That was terrible. Whatever. My phone. Hold on, let me just turn down the brightness so for a second. Oh wow, that looks incredible on the YouTube screen. Look at that, YouTubers. Well, let's go on to my YouTube. A lot of you have been commenting, what the bleep is that static in the background? Well, I'm basically gonna tell you what that static is in the background. And I was not aware of that. I really wasn't. So, iPhone, if you are, if you have an iPhone and you want to watch my videos, please don't, because this is what's going to happen. My videos aren't even up. Well, basically mine, where's your video?
That's the static. Bye.